How you doing? Is Morbius going to be the best champion in MCOC or is he bound to get nerfed? What are you talking about? As you can see based on the title. Well, you know, and I, I hope he doesn't get nerfed. You know, in the past, when I talk about champions that are overpowered, they end up getting nerfed. The only ones that didn't get nerfed that was overpowered was Diablo and Scorpion. And look how they turned out. Diablo being the best buff in the MCOC. And then you got Scorpion, the best science champion in the game. So I hope he doesn't get nerfed, but it seems like he's bound to get nerfed. Personally, I don't think Kabam should nerf him because it would just be terrible marketing for them if he gets nerfed. Because, you know, this is the first time Kabam has released a champion that the public can afford, you know. And then for him to get nerfed, it would be really disappointing, you know. It would be, I think, for if he turned out he doesn't get nerfed and he becomes the best champion in MCOC, it just seems like a really good marketing for Kabam. Like people actually, wow, you know, I want to actually spend money in the game because I can have the best champion in the game, you know. So what am I talking about? So let's start about talk about um, Galen first. So when it comes to Galen, I'm going to show you. When it comes to his harvest, is the last paragraph. The harvest lasts 14, for 14 seconds. When the harvest ends, Galen consumes all planetary mass to deal a burst of 230.63 direct damage for each planetary mass. Consume this damage scales with base attack only and is half on defense. So the most important thing about when it comes to Galen's burst damage, it is base attack only. I want to say it again, base attack only. And it's really unfortunate for Galen that his burst damage only base attack only. I think he could have been a, the best the best cosmic champion in the MCOC if that wasn't it was modified not base attack only, you know. And he would have been so much fun to much more fun to play like in questing, you know, because you can run damage mastery, boost and synergy. It would have been so much better for Galen. He would have been so much people would actually want to play him more for like long fights and I think for personally like you know for me I think he would be so much fun in incursions you know instead of just you know he would arguably be like the most important champion you know in in incursion if if he was actually usable not just somebody to use for just for his free fight you know if he was modified because in incursion you know you can you can increase your damage easily so you know so people would like you can see his burst damage doing over a million easily you know he could have the highest damage in incursion if it was uh if he was modified instead of base attack only so it's unfortunate for Gallen that his burst damage is only modified it would have been really fun i believe in incursions to see so what am I talking about exactly? When it comes to Mega Sentinel, look at Mega Sentinel Special Attack Three. On activation, consume all personal incinerate and plasma debuffs on the opponent. Deal a burst of six thousand one hundred thirty-six energy damage for each debuff consumed. So that's really roughly about sixteen, seventeen uh, incinerates. She can stack up to twenty incinerates on the opponent. Okay. So about roughly 16 incinerates. When you when you have 16 incinerates on the opponent and then you throw your special attack three, it's gonna deal a burst damage of about a hundred thousand. Okay? And that is going to be modified with damage mastery. So if you're running damage mastery, you will yield about a hundred and sixty thousand damage. Okay? 160,000 damage and if you're using boost with damage mastery that will yield over 200,000 damage if you have 17 incinerate on the opponent think about it because it's modified not like with Galen as you could see with Galen it says space attack only with Omega Sentinel it doesn't say that and that's why it, when you see the damage comparison and you could do it yourself you know, without damage mastery and damage mastery, you can see there's a big difference because it's modified. So when it comes to Morbius, 
I don't when it comes to his medium attacks. Iconic light medium attack is passively unblockable and gains plus 9817.5 attack rating. I do believe that is modified, not base attack only. So if you're running damage mastery, that will yield over 15,000 attack rating. So I believe this is a six star rank five Morbius on the on the website. So over 15,000 attack rating if it's modified. So so if you I know there are a few people that plays battlegrounds. So if you're running that if you're not running damage mastery, this will pretty much have no impact on you. But if you are running damage mastery, this will have an definitely an impact on your damage for sure if it's modified. You know, I do think it's really would be great for a quest, which is the most important thing in the game. You know, that you know this is modified would be awesome because you not only can run uh, damage mastery you can run boost as well as synergy to increase your attack you know per personally for me what i enjoy watching the most is incursion this will actually have the biggest impact too on because when it comes to incursion you can increase your damage by 10 times easily by 10 times you know so when you have your keep it going hack way more than 10 times okay when, when it comes to um, your attack so you could see morbius doing easily over a million damage with his medium attack assuming it's modified so it's a special attack you know you know especially you have the perpetual offense i think it shouldn't affect perpetual offense like it should be modified when it comes to professional offense i don't know about the other increase attack but when it comes to professional offense that would make sense absolute sense that it's modified so when it comes to a special two it sh he's going to be able to do over a million damage easily if it's modified you know if you have the right hacks so you know i think morbius can even out damage angela if 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 only you want to get to zone 25 an incursion you know and Angela when it comes to incursion she is broken I mean balance balance I don't know what the heck I just said broken no a Angela is absolutely not broken in incursion she is completely balanced okay so forget what I said she is completely balanced in incursion <coughs> okay yeah so yeah so I would really hope that it is modified I Think that special attack 2 should definitely be modified when it comes to the professional offense when you get a prowess buff it just makes sense and i hope when it comes to the attack medium and special attack 2 it should i hope it is modified and he will be the best champion in mcoc the plain sight and it would be good marketing for kabam you know if it was because you know first time you know the public can afford a champion you know that's going to be the best champion in mcoc it will just be great so i'm really looking forward for um morbius in incursion assuming the it's modified when it comes to his medium attack as well as his special attack too thank you